Hey guys, it's the channel vlog and more here with some really exciting news and we now have our first official um, We have some information on the Lego Toy Fair um, Summer 2016 set reports um, Thanks to UK's website Brick Fanatics um, A little shout out to them. Uh, we have some information on what we're going to be getting in the summer wave of stuff for 2016 with many of Lego's themes so this is their information, and uh, a little shout out to them. Um, and I will also be covering over, you know, brick sets as well. So, of course, thanks again to London Toy Fit or Brick Fanatics for the information. So, Lego's also been apparently more secretive to them, according to them with their um, their reports. So, without further ado, let's talk about what we're getting. So, first up is seven six zero five seven. This is for Marvel. The Web Warriors Bridge Battle, it will have a hundred it will be a hundred pounds, so probably about $120, which is gonna be surprising. The main figures of this set is gonna be Spider-Man, Spider Girl, could be Gwen Stacy, Sp Scarred Spider, Aunt May, Green Goblin, Scorpion, and Scorpion. And it comes with a New York taxi falling through a hole in the bridge, which that really sounds awesome. Next up is 76058 Ghost Rider Team Up. This will be 20 pounds, so probably like $20 here. We get Spider-Man, we get Ghost Rider, going to be exciting. And we also get the Hobgoblin for the first time. Yes, we're getting the Hobgoblin, a very unknown character. I remember the Hobgoblin from the old Spider-Man TV series. He's jet thing, he has a jet, and then he has a huge bike, which is about the size of Wild Style's bike from the, wow, or from the Super Cycle Chase, which is just recently retired. For Ghost Riders, and it has the normal chain pieces in a trans flame color, similar to what we're seeing right now in the Nexo Knights theme. Next up is 76059, which is the Doc Ock's tentacle trap. We 45 pounds. We'll have Spider Man, Quasic Doc Ock, White Tiger, Captain Stacy with the 12 Doctor's hair, and Peter Bankman's too, and Vulture and a giant Doc Ock mech. And then for 35 pounds, we have a Doctor Strange set, which is a vignette style build which is in his lab and has bookshelves, table, and portal with red tentacle demon beast coming through the Sanctum Sanctorum probably. He doesn't know, they don't know the minifigures, and they said someone holding a chain with a trans-orange radar dish and someone holding two fans. So that's for Marvel. Now onto DC, we have um, Scarecrow's Harvest of Fear, 76054, will be 60 pounds. We'll have Scarecrow, an unknown what version, but it will be probably the... Um, I don't know, but maybe it'd be the 2013 one from the Arkham Asylum set. Who knows? And then we have a farmer. We have Anti-Gas Batman. And you're going to like this, guys. Keller Moth. I remember Keller Moth from Teen Titans. And it features a Batcopter. Yeah. And Scarecrow's Combine Harvester Vehicle. Next up is 76055. Killer Croc Sewer Smash will be 70 pounds. It will have a big fig Killer Croc. Doesn't look like a hinged jaw and has no chains, apparently. We also get Captain Boomerang, Red Hood with a printed face, and we're also getting Katana. I remember Katana from Beware the Batman, so that's going to be super awesome to get her. Then we have a Junior set, if you remember, 70724. The Juniors, um, Batman, Superman vs. Lex Luthor, which will be 30 euros and it will, or pounds, and there's nothing new. It's the Green Blue Superman, or Batman, sorry, and the older Superman, and then Lex Luthor, which is green armor piece he's had before back in 2012. Next up for Star Wars is, he says it's a bit of a letdown with repeated builds and uninspired new vehicles from the Star Wars TV series. Lots of main figures were obscured and not named, including on the calendar. For 35 pounds, there's the Eclipse Fire, which will have too many figures. 75145, then there's which is based on a new IP, the Star Scavenger, another new IP set, 75147, Star Scavenger, which will have 50 pounds, four minifigures, and will come with a mini salvage vehicle, 75148, the encounter on Jakku, we are game War Force Awakens sets, this one will have basically the scene where Tito is on a Lugger Beast trying to snare, um, you know, trying to capture BB-8, and it comes with Unkar Plutt, which is going to be cool, we get Ray again, we get BB-8, we also get Tito, and a brick-built Lugger Beast. That will be 50 pounds. First 80 pounds, this will probably be $8. 75149, the Resistance X-Wing is practically a recover of Poe's X-Wing fire. We get four minifigures in that set. And, of course, um, Darth Vader's TIE Advance. It's probably a Rebel set. It will be 30 pounds. Kind of doubt that, um, like Just Too Good said. 
um, 75150. It would be Darth Vader's TIE Advance. As I mentioned, it has a solid looking TIE Advance and an A Wing that shoots and will have four minifigures for 100 pounds. This one, I'm kind of, you know, wondering about this one. 75151 will be the clone turbo tank. It will have um, a built in handle and some decent suspension, sun suspension, and we'll have six minifigures. And then we have 75147 Captain Rex's ATT Walker, which will have 100. Will be a hundred pounds, and we'll have five minifigures, complete rebuild from previous version, and it's more robust. Next up, we have the city line. This is kind of exploring. We have the volcano explorers. It uses rock and ice pieces as volcanic rock with a crystal element inside, and it's very lined with some yellow. So six zero one two zero to two four is um, the volcano, respectively for eight for nine pounds. The volcano star set exploration truck fifteen pounds. Volcano crawler. 25 pounds volcano supply helicopter 40 pounds and the volcano research base for 80 pounds and it has a small vehicle built from burps big ol rock pieces and it has an exploding function a mobile exploration vehicle and mineral analyzer drill thing on a small caterpillar tracks and there is a new version of the drill piece which seems interesting now for city we have uh the airport stuff and um the set numbers are 60104, passenger or terminal, which will be 80 pounds. It will be blue and gray with new wings, so new airport. Then we have 60100, star set, which will be 9 pounds, 4 minifigures. And then we have 60102, VIP service, which will be 40 pounds. We will have a 4 stud wide white limo and a private jet, which sounds very interesting. We have 60103, an air show. That sounds interesting. Really cool. 70 pounds. We'll have six minifigures and a stunt show and a couple of red arrow looking planes with a new thin cockpit piece and also female stunt riding an orange biplane. And then cargo place, 18 pounds, 60101. Next up, we have creator, which is 31049. The dual helicopter, which will be 20 pounds. Cape Lighthouse, 301051 which will have be 40 pounds, and we'll have a brick-built large orca. Ooh, killer whale. Or, or is it a whale? I'm not sure. But they just say killer whale on it, so I'm not sure. And then Lighthouse lights up and detaches from the rest of the set. Then 30152 to 53, we have the vacation getaways. 50 pounds with a big white and blue RV with fold-out awning and a brick bear, bear and 31053 Treehouse Adventures which is um, 25 euros. So, yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'm going to stay tuned for more um, news. Bye, guys.